pouring as in the wet it's going to be a hell of a race um, we're just taking our, our grid our start here about to start in pole position Jeffro again and waiting rev cars are revving up lights are turning about to go green and off we go and what a start off we and we are in the race into second of Neville Junior into third as a newcomer to the sport you all know him Zane in the third is Neville in second but he's getting pushed by car number six as he lost it he's still in second um, and in third place there it looks like it's Zane up to and up we go into the third corner second corner we're coming up to um, Jeffro Zane has got under braking, he's going to make it stop, he does, and he takes in, looks like he's going to go to second. Zane's in second place, car number six in third, and Neville Jr. in fourth. Down the pack we go, uh, DC Racing in fifth. As we come back up here, the front pack is having a race, and some guys, and it's about braking. Neville Jr. is going to the side, DC Racing going off, he's off. The track also went off, something happened then with, with some braking problems there. Back in the lead, Jared, then Zane, second and third, is, it looks like it's Mr. Big. And in fourth is the Renee team, and he's current day, looks like he's got a handle. He's running an eye in the pack, it's a wet circuit. This behind him looks like also a newcomer to the sport. Got some new drivers in fourth here. Back to Renee. And he's there in still in fourth position, chasing down the man in third. That, that's big. Um, and then in second is Zane and then Jared. These two guys know each other very well to the to the world of motorsport, especially the oval track. And they are chasing each other down. As we come down to the first corner, Zane looks like he's taking the lead. Zane is taking the lead. Jeffro out on the brakes and there's some pumping going on there. Oh Jeffro takes back the, the lead. Zane and back in second and they had some bumping them. Um, don't know what the CSC will think about that, but let's go on racing. And it's a good pack here with Jared in first and Zane's all over him. Coming to the corner. What does Zane do? On the brake, Zane's to the inside. He's just taking a gentle there, but car number six is also interfering there. Car number six, the man in third is coming to the party here. And it's a good party. Down to fourth, fifth. 6, 7 and 8, 9, there's your pack of cars, they were this and having a fight with DC Racing and looks like DC Racing is just covering his points off, they were into the, into a point that is and DC Racing is still doing good and Rene is off, Rene has thrown it, he's going to do some hard work, let's go back to the leaders and they got um, Jeffro in first, Zane is having a fight of car with big um, car number, the man in third and it's a good race this Jeffro leading the race he's also leading the championship Zane is a new guy to the to the party here and running second he's showing his mint here for business the man in third position um, also new to the to the sport um, also showing the pace he can run with the top guys so Jared is gonna I mean Jeffro is gonna have his hands worked out here Zane in set in there in second with big show coming a big coming up and saying and Z Max uh, is catching he's catching up let's go back to the leaders into the first corner while oh, taking corner then third man yeah comes stop and um, Mac they make that a new main band um, to the pack car number 33 and he's having a good touch lovely sponsors on let's go back to the leaders and it looks like a Zane is caught up again. They had a good drive. What does Zane do here? Um, not up. Jeffro is just looks like he's having to defend his lines. Um, Big has lost a bit of momentum there. And back to the leader. This really looks good. It's just good racing. Je um, Jared, I mean Jeffro is just there, but Zane is looking for a place to pass. And Coming out this corner here, yeah, it's Zane is still all over him. The man on fire at the moment. Je Jeffro is lo looks like he's defending at the moment. He's not on the pace he wants to be. Um, Zane is there all over him. 
the man in third position has really lost out a big a big gap back to the leaders and this looks good this looks good for motorsport this is good for what you want to see a nice challenge guys please take note that jared i mean jeffro is wearing a 50 kg penalty and um, his car is 50 kg lighter than than Shane's car so but the racing is good saying they're looking for the second jeffro is just depending on the track at the moment these two guys are doing excellent and Zane, Zane's going for the inside, Zane's got the inside there, what's going to happen to that con? And Zane takes the lead, Zane's in first, Zane in the lead, but Jeffro has just took the undercut and took the lead back. It's going to be a good dance, this is lap 4 guys, it's a good, good dance to be. Let's leave the leaders and let's go to the third man, um, new member. He's also on normal weights. He's got. He just joined this um, this race. Um, then C Mac. Uh, yeah, C Mac's got a penalty of slow down. Um, something new that came to the um, to the track. His penalty is all taken. Um, man in fifth position runs wide. Also a new driver. And Neville Neville Junior is in sixth position at the moment. He's running third in the championship. So it's not where he wants to be and um, he's going to be working hard the man in 7th is also new got to the championship but DC Racing has got the inside now number 79 close to the door also a new member to our to, to our party DC Racing um, well, he's, a, he's a yummy driver he's got the pace but I think this wetness is just for someone but someone went off oh number 79 went off and has lost a lot of momentum the man in in ninth position, Rene team is just um, having a bad day. It looks like it's um, off the pace and all over the track. Back in the leaders, we still got um, Jeffro leading, but Saints all over him. This is a close race. We start to start lap number five, and um, Zane is getting attacked by by um, by Jeffro. Um, Jeffro um, looks like Zane is taking the lead. Uh, Jeffro gets the power out. He's powering out. Jeffro back in the lead, but Zane's not leaving this. Zane is actually just pressurizing Jeffro to make a mistake, but it, but it looks like, oh, Zane has passed. He's in the lead now, but now coming to this corner where the brakes have to be great. Jeffro moves in the lead again, but let's see what happens. Zane goes for the undercut. Jeffro saws it comes in and he closes the door. Zane just goes behind him and tries to, try to use the steps to Back in a man in third, you can see the body was happening in the front and um, if anything goes wrong, this man will, will, will um, benefit on it. And again, Zane in the lead, again, uh, slum slightly out of there, but it's soft and changing, some touching them, nothing serious, but Zane's in the lead, Zane's got the run, can he run it? Um, to start Jeffro. Oh, Jeffro has slightly made a mistake there, but um, he had the race line and slightly pushed Zane off the line. And Zane's got to push now back, coming up to the SSM. Zane's got a slightly big in the penalty of backing the corner to the left. And um, back in the third, man, this guy is meaning business, new to the, new to the car, new to the championship. And he's only around two, so he can make up points. C Max, um, he's running fourth in the championship, so he's lying fourth, yeah. But he would love to be higher up with the points. Also, a new member to us, and DC Racing is putting him under pressure. And he's doing excellent good coming out of this corner. It looks good for for a newcomer, but Neville Junior and DC Racing is not letting this man have, have anything easy to run. Then. Um, DC Racing looks like he's gonna move into into six season six, but Neville has run off the track and made a mistake. Neville made a mistake and that's gonna cost him. The 79 is not far from him. So Neville made a slightly mistake here at lap number six. And Rene is still running loss. I think he's just trying to figure out what's wrong with his car. Back in the backyard. Jeffro in the lead, Zane under brakes and the car's just swiveled but he's 
kept it cool. Didn't lose anything. He had a little lead there and is out again back in second. These two guys is really, really racing and it's a very good race to watch. Um, welcome to Falcon Polo Cup Racing. This is what, what we wanted to, to bring out from, from the Falcon and these two guys are doing it. As um, Jared uh, Jeffro is really under pressure here by Zane. Um, his car is 50 kg lighter, heavier than, than Zane's car, but the pressure Zane is putting on him is just keeping it. Zane's into the inside of the corner and keeping it in. And Jeffro runs wide a bit, but Zane's got the drive. And Wally come out, Zane's in the lead. Well done, Zane is in the lead, and Jeffro is now in second. And Zane looks like someone's got a penalty. Zane has got a penalty, um, cutting corner. So not very good from this from the tracks here, see. But it looks like Jeffrey comes back in into first. Jeffrey in the lead, Zane in second, and number the third man is just hanging out there, but he's losing now. He's definitely losing pace. Z Max has got a track penalty, and TC Racing is catching with number 33 due to the to to, um, to Falcon Polo Cup. But he's mixing it with one of the top drivers then. Then Neville is um, back in the front pack here. This is where the, the, the crowd wants to be. These two guys, Jared, uh, Zane, uh, Zane and Jeffro. Jeffro in the lead. Zane is following hard here. And on the brakes and bumping and turning. As these two guys are not leaving each other alone. Zane is looking for a way and Jared is just hoping, sorry, I mean Jeffrey is just hoping the track gets a bit track, with a dryer that he can get more traction. These two guys and Jeff and Zane sees a gap but Jeffrey pulls out nicely and now they block in and defending, you're only allowed to move once and that's a proof. Now Jeffrey will keep the inside and Zane will drive his racing line and get some momentum back into the next corner. Looking good as they are coming up for power. Slipstreaming city. This is excellent racing. As Zane is following the slipstream and will maybe get the momentum to go up. He's in the lead. Zane in the lead. Can he keep the brakes? Got it. Can he get the car stopped? He can and he's in there. Jeffrey tries to undercut but Zane says no this time. And Zane's leading for a, for a good couple of kilom uh, kilometers, I would say, this time. And, um, but Jeffrey has now cut the, cut, cut the switch part and he comes out to show him he's there. It's going to be a breaking point and Jeffrey is in the lead. Or oh, Zane go for the undercut. And Jeffrey, he goes for the undercut. That's how Jeffrey can't touch the door. But Jeffrey gets good traction out of the corner. Does he? Um, well, yeah, Jeffrey did. Jeffrey got good traction out of the corner and Zane moves into second. Jeffrey in the front. With two left to go, this is... And, um, sorry, I mean Jeffrey, but... Zane gets an underdraft and can he pull? And Jeffrey gets a better draft out of it. It's it's well to watch. It's it's really, really well to watch. It's on the final lap, guys. And these guys are pushing now. Onto the next corner. Oh, some slightly bumping from Zane, but he's looking for a way. And comes out to the corner. It's looking tough. As Zane is pushing hard, but Jeffrey is still in the lead. But Zane is looking for a mistake that that um Jeffrey can bake, but Zane's got the inside. It's going to be close. Who's going to get the, the better drive out of there? Oh, push Jeffrey off. Oh, some mistakes. There's some mistakes there. Um, something to see. See who's going to love to have to watch. But what a push there. Zane's in the lead. On a couple of more corners to go. It's, can it, will it end up in cheers? Or will it be something good? But Jeffrey now is in the lead. Into the, lo into the second last corner. Jeffrey's in the lead. And it's coming out to a point where this could be a last corner, last, last desperate move. And it's a push from Zane, but looks like Jeffrey does. There's a penalty, but looks like that was a close finish in the third place. And it will be third for him. Coming down into fourth, Z Max with DC Racing. Um, then down to Neville Jr. for this race. Well done guys, thanks for watching.